from Gaming Cult Podcast, which is another podcast. Oh, know. Gaming Cult. Okay. Oh, we're live. Hello. Welcome. What the hell is this? Sorry, what? Hello? Well, hello? Listen, I'm, I'm very I'm very famous, and so don't worry about it. How about it. the 4th edition podcast? Oh, yeah, but, but you don't care about the But, I, but, but I'm very, very famous. Very important. We're all important here because this is the internet. We're all influencers. Speaking of, um, my influencing today, I'm drinking uh, brownie caramel cream root beer since 1929. That's right, oh, almost wait. 100 years. Brownie caramel cream root beer? That sounds oh. amazing. Where yeah. do you get that? Well, it's, it's brownie is the brand. I think it's just caramel oh. cream root beer. Oh, fuck okay. that. I want but it's still good. It's it, 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 it tastes like... Um, it almost tastes like butterbeer a little bit, like a but like a little more root beery. All right, I'm back again. There's a lot going on there. Yeah, yeah. What's the uh, what's the sugar? Uh, oh yeah, let's do the nu- nutrition facts. Um, you know, twelve fluid ounces. Uh, forty three grams of sugar. Oh. Fuck. <laughs> How many servings in one bottle? Um. The bottle's one serving. They're they're okay. not they're not being deceitful. They're not pulling a sneaky like sneak. One yeah. One bottle is like four serving. Oh yeah, or like three and a half or something. Like yeah. Man, that better, that better taste good that much. Yeah, it's all right. I mean, it's a nice little treat every once in a while. Yeah. 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 Oh. <laughs> what the fuck are we doing? So, welcome. Fucking brownie beer, man. Welcome, yes, questing crew, yeah. Um, so last last time. Uh, last time on Questing Crew, let me let me try to catch everyone up. Uh, basically, uh, you through your adventures, you've met a guy whose kid Chucky is in a coma, and he was working for Biotechnica in the company you guys have been doing stuff for. And uh, he his dad has sent you on a series of missions that have essentially led you to being able to access his son's private network to access whatever it is you need uh, to be able to get his uh, son out of the coma. And so you've gone into a system, you're in a VR kind of interface, and you've gone through all these kind of a couple of trials and stuff, and you came across this computer that had a text-based adventure game on it. Um, You played the text-based adventure game for a little bit and got to a point where all of a sudden uh, the, uh, the the VR world around you turned into the, uh, the adventure game. And so that's where we are now. Uh, let me uh, switch camera angles here. Uh, where is the... Oh, <laughs> here it is. Uh, move you guys over. Here we are. We are... Uh, in the uh, VR game, uh, or in the the uh, point and click, or the text-based adventure game, which was a, I believe it was called uh, Evil Cabin Three, yeah. Um, and yeah, you are in the uh, kind of the living room of the Evil Cabin, uh, the titular Evil Cabin. Uh, so to your left is kind of a like a, a a desk with a chair in front of it and just some objects kind of strewn about uh to your right is a fireplace with like a rocking chair and like a rug um and then over to your, to the left corner is just kind of a is a rug that looks like a just kind of a sheet that looks like it's just been kind of thrown there nice. and then in the very back straight back is just like a door that rug. and the, and then yeah. behind you is the front door Check under the rug. Check under the rug. Would you call that a throw rug? Which one? The one that's just Wait, there's rug. multiple rugs? Well, I, I, oh yeah, I guess technically, yeah, the thing to the left is like, just like a blanket or something. Yeah. Um. So yeah, the so you want to move the rug? Yeah, yes. Okay. Oh. I want to find the creepy steps oh. into the basement. Oh. You move the you move the rug. Uh, Here, let me get here. Oh, this literally is Evil Dead, isn't it? Yeah. Would you have control over our characters right now? I think that's one thing. Um, oh, can you not? Okay. You move the rug and, and there's nothing there. Oh, fuck. <laughs> um, is there, let me see. Oh, yeah, I got to uh, attach you guys to like it, to the characters or whatever. I'd like to get attached. Um, I'd like to immediately hack into the source code and write this. Okay, here, here we go. I remember, I remember how to do this now. 
You got to copy and paste the dudes from the other one. Makes it a little easier. Put that glue on. So yeah, let me go ahead and... And then... There we go. Now you, should, now, you should, now you guys should be able to move around. All right, I guess I'm over here by the rug. Okay, so yeah. Don't fucking stand on top of me. <laughs> Get the fuck off here. Are you sure there's nothing under this rug? Uh, just some uh old floorboards. Oh, what if, the, what if there's a creaky loose floorboard though? Who's who's vested? Uh, uh, at determining if there's a secret passage under the floorboards. Perception check? Perception. I, I, get sure yeah. I don't think is. hearing could do all of that, but... but you, just, I mean, instead of you could hear if, like, there's, like, something under under it or something, maybe. Yeah. yeah. We should let the musician... We should let the musician who has the keen sense of hearing do that. Mm -hmm. Let's see. How do I... Hear? I rolled a 16. I knock on the floor and listen. See if there's shit under there. Okay. Um, let me move back here. Okay, so you rolled 16. Okay. Um, with that, um, I mean, you can doubt, you can hear. Um, so what did you say? You like kind of like knocked on the floor or whatever. Mm -hmm. Okay, you knock on the floor. And you do hear, like, it kind of echo around down there, but, like, it seems like there's not, like, any immediate way right there to get down there. I disagree. Irving, use your gun. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Shoot the floor. Mm. Yeah. Why don't we Shoot check the door? I'll make our own opening. <laughs> All right. Yeah, give it a shot. Like I, I'm. Do that Looney Tunes thing of like shooting a hole around you so that you yeah, fall circle. Through. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, give it a shot. I'll make a circle with bullets. Yeah. All right. So what am I hitting here for that rug? Uh, I'm not sure. It, Let me it, see. Shoot gun skill. <laughs> Cause that would be. What, what would that be? Isn't there like a isn't there like a shoot gun? Yeah. I mean, I would I would say it's more of a a dexterity kind of thing, I guess. Cuz you're not you're not it's not a combat thing, so you wouldn't use like oh, okay. the combat rolls. Um Is there a chance of him missing the floor? Yeah, he could shoot one of us he, in the foot. He could it could like, I don't know, something could happen. You never know. Yeah. Okay. This is this is Rob's world to bend at his will. Like, you know, Rob. Robbie. It's like, yeah, it's like the really good cartoon with Howie Mandel, Robbie's World. Oh, yeah. fuck. This is so good now that I have two monitors, I can put my character uh, fucking thing on another one and stay. Oh, even I wasn't a TM. Dude, I'm <laughs> such a fucking pro gamer. <laughs> I'm such a pro gamer now. You guys like... You're, yeah, you're, you're breaking the meta. I my own fucking emotes and everything. Whoa. Hey, big time. <laughs> wow. Where's my dexterity? Yeah. Uh, it should be like the uh, third thing in your in your list. And under your oh. attributes. And your attributes, oh. yeah. Your old dex. That old dex. I think you would have to just actually just roll a d10 and then add. Oh, okay. It's yeah. No, er, how this game works is you can't just roll like strength. You have to. It's all based on skill rolls. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. What what skill is? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. There you go. Roll mark marksmanship. That's perfect. Yeah. That's what. That's yeah. That's way better. Yeah. All right. Got it. All right. Ooh. Eighteen. Okay. Um. So. Yeah. You shoot. Um. Just. Your. Um. You should have been an artist. You draw just like a perfect circle on the ground, with bullets. And it's just like tear, it's just tearing through this old old wood that's been there forever, just tearing through it. Um, and then you stop when it looks like it's like kind of about about ready to go. Um, and then all of a sudden you hear kind of like some glitchy kind of noises, and um, like almost po polygons kind of start reappearing, and it like like where the holes kind of rebuild themselves. 
Oh, so the pool's repairing itself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Like a bunch of, yeah, it looks like, like, like green outline polygons kind of come in and like kind of fill in the spots and right. turns it back to well, where guess, it was. I guess we got to do this the way it was designed. Uh, <laughs> ah, shit. All right. Uh, how about this rug? To the left. There's like a sh there's just like a sheet there's just like a sheet on the ground or yeah. Oh, that's where the dead body is. Watch out. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna lift it. Where the zombies are. All right. Um, you're gonna lift the sheet. I'm gonna lift it. All right. Nerdlinger lifts the sheet, and there is a secret hatch. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> 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 I was hoping it would play out that way, and I'm glad it did. I don't trust this. <laughs> I, don't, I don't trust like that. Don't trust like that. That's not the real secret hatch. There's so much <clears throat> more of this. But oh, hey, the, the the here's the trick though. The secret hatch it has a bunch of uh, chains and stuff on it, and it looks like it has uh, three uh, padlocks that have like keyholes oh, on them. Okay. So we can do this the right way or I can just uh, hack these padlocks out of existence let's do it the right way okay let's do it the right way <laughs> <laughs> this is the hard <coughs> you made me a hacker and put me in a hacker world and I can't use my hacker power well you can try it yeah you can I mean you can always try sometimes that's not fun I like to play the game well I mean you know it's it's hey, there in here? All right, I'm gonna yeah, walk so in here so let's, let's back here oh, oh shit okay you're moving on me okay um oh yeah okay so, um, let me get the old pencil out here. Um, you go into that hallway, and in front of you, you see, let me draw them in real quick. You see a door. Oh. Four doors. Oh, shit. A sedan. Maybe we need to check one room. Well, here's the thing. Clearly, the smart move would be to all to stay together, but if we're trying to play by the rules of this game, I think we all immediately uh must split up and i go in this door and close that door oh <laughs> well okay okay um so you go in that door and you close the door and um when you close wait, wait wait let me let me finish real quick wait wait wait, wait. Oh, sorry, I was gonna lock um you. when you close the door it uh click you hear a click uh behind you um and then in front of you is just like um and let's see here in front of uh yeah, right. In front of you is just like a wall, like all three walls, like basically like a U shape, mm -hmm. like that you kind of walk into from the door is just a a wall of just like buttons and knobs and oh, like oh, USB oh. ports and just oh my God. weird little dude, like kind of puzzly looking doodads and like little gears and levers and it, it looks like the most ridiculous. Uh, like adventure game puzzle you've ever seen. Like it just looks ridiculous. Like this ridiculous, crazy thing. It's crazy okay. co walls contraptions. All right, cool. Uh, okay. Is there is there anything that maybe I look at I could see as like maybe a starting point? Um, I mean there is. is hacker sense. There is like a a gear or or not a gear like a a wheel that you can kind of turn. Okay. That looks like like and and like like I said, there's just like like I said like, I, I take that back. The USB part, I take that back. It's it's like oh, a bunch man. of like gears and. <laughs> immediately take back the thing that lets me hack. Yeah, I, I didn't. Yeah, I was I was in, that, Yeah, yeah. Perfect. It was yeah okay. like gears and like yeah like I said, just like a really convoluted looking like, uh, not necessarily yeah. steampunk, but like yeah, just like a, like a mist looks like a mist does puzzle. It, there you go. That's what I'm like. Going there's for. a gear missing that I need to like <clears> move around. Um. It does look like there's like one gear, kind of missing, like one big gear. Uh, I look around for a gear. Uh, it looks like there's no gear. Okay, can I leave this room or is it locked? No, it's it's locked. Okay, I just pound on the door. Guys, find me a big gear and slip it through the bottom of the door. How are you supposed to uh, get underneath a door? Yeah, there's not a there was not a gap big enough for that. Oh, okay. I'd like to use my interface skill to hack the program and make a little slip through the door. Are you sh oh, okay. <laughs> no, I won't. I'm, 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 I won't <laughs> okay. I, I'm, that that um, response means like that's really pointless, but you can do it. 
Okay, so I guess I'm <laughs> in here somewhere. All right. Uh, okay, so you have your setup. Uh, yeah. So who 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 went into a thing next? Irving already entered one, so he's fucked. Let's do it. <laughs> I'm, I'm in there, but I had to close the door behind me. You slammed nah, the door close, behind me. Nah, closes I'm, on you. I um, close the door. Uh, okay, yeah, you, you, like, they don't automatically close or anything, so yeah, like, it's oh, still open. Yeah. Um, backup, I'm leaving it open, but I'm Alright, so yeah, you walk in there, and it's, it's, uh, it's the bathroom. Um, nothing too out of the ordinary. All There's, right. like, uh, here's, like, the tub. <laughs> Here's like the sink. He closed the door. Here's like the turlet. And you close the door and uh oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, hold on. The what? The turlet. Turlet. The, what? the toilet. The I'm making a goof. Oh, yeah. Um what do you call it, Ryan? Toilet. Uh you close the door and uh nothing happens. It doesn't lock or anything. Oh, right. I'll be I'll be out in a minute. Someone else check another room. <laughs> they have toilet paper in there. It's Look in the uh, yeah, there's toilet paper. Let me draw some. Yeah. Yeah, there's some toilet paper right there. The door. Look, look in the toilet tank. All right. All right. I'm, I'm doing <laughs> All right. I'm, no, hold on. I'll do this. I'm, I'm craning my neck around. I'm, look, I'm opening the tank. I'm checking in there. Is there anything in the toilet tank? There's just uh, water and, like, that little rubber ball thing and, like, the yeah. little lever and oh, stuff. Like yeah, just your to typical toilet stuff. Yeah. Okay, hold on. Time out. If you're in VR... And you're taking a shit. <laughs> Does that mean you're also taking a shit? In the no, world? of course we'll find, not. We'll find out once we take the well, car. You car just, car. everyone, everyone just suddenly hears a faint, like, what the fuck? Like, <laughs> from, uh, from Chucky's dad. <laughs> right. right. Wash your hands. There's no, there's no, uh, there's no germs. Well, all right. I, <laughs> no, you've immediately contracted virtual corona. Virtuona. Virtuona. Virtuona rider. There's no germs in VR, man. I, I might need some, I need to infect some digital enemies. enemies. <laughs> yeah, there you go. That might be. You never know. There might be like some crazy mist puzzle that involves yeah, bacteria. Right. Um, okay, you open the door to the room in the top right, and it's just kind of really dark in there. Like, it's just like, like, there's like no lights, no windows. Um, you feel around for a light switch, and you find one, and you kind of flip it a bunch, but like, it doesn't do anything. Okay. Um you walk in and you the with the personal assistant, whatever it's called. Yeah, but that's in the real world. We're in a computer. Oh yeah, that's that's right. Um well, so yeah, you have our power we have and shit. Oh, that's right. That's right. Okay. That's too much. That's that's Okay, you know what? Here. Um I think you need to find a normal ass You pull you pull out your P, uh PDA, PA or whatever and uh you click the flashlight and it turns on for like a split second, but then you hear like those same kind of glitchy noises from earlier and it kind of flickers out. Oh man! So it's just completely pitch black in there, or is there any light? Um, when you like, there's like some light coming from uh the hallway, but that not not enough to like really. You can sort of see like kind of silhouettes of things in there, but. I forgot my character. I forgot he has low light vision. Does that help? Nice. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Um, that completely like slipped my mind. No, but your 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 character has low light vision, but this is not the real world again. Well, you know, it's what, what, what am I? You're you're fully equipped with your gear. I walked around as a stick figure. What's going on? Well, I'm a hacker, so I'm God in here. Oh man. Okay. There are three I'm passwords I'm that everyone uses that you shouldn't. God. Um. So. Um. Uh. Yeah. You have you have your gear and stuff. Yeah. Um. I'll take a look around if I can see. It's just like it just seems it seems like whenever you're using your gear in a way that seems to try to subvert some of the rules of the game, it kind of 
fights back to, to that, is what it seems like. I want to check this through. So, so, okay. So, um, low light, is there any sort of, is that just like a passive thing? Just the uh, low yeah, light thing? Okay. It seems like it's almost like, um, like supernaturally dark. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Okay. I'll just leave that room for them. I, I don't want to black in there. I don't want to get caught. Okay. We've been, in, we've been in three rooms. We haven't found one key so far. Well, you found a. Somewhere. Found a puzzle for a key, probably. Yeah. Wait, check in the bathtub, like. Saw. Maybe oh, it went down the. Oh shoot! All right, I'm going back <laughs> to the bathroom. Don't do what you did in there before. Da, da, da. You f oh, wait. You find in the bathtub. You find uh, like a little rubber ducky. Oh, fuck. Oh, what do you do when you squeeze it? Squeeze. It squeaks. It gives a little squeak. Is, is there anything inside the jingle in here? No, just a squeak. Just a cute little rubber ducky. Hold on. Is is there water in the tub or is it? It's empty. You can take a bath. <laughs> well, no, because we saw that you, you know you gotta take the water over out of it. But... Alright. Um, right. I don't know I'll about this guy. I'll open this door. Yeah. Take us to that one. All right. You open up the door to the last room, and um, it um, it like in the floor plan, it looks like it's like a normal sized room. But you open it up, and it's kind of just like an impossibly large room. Um, and uh, there's kind of just like a big pit that goes from wall to wall uh, from left to right in the middle of the room. Um, so here, let me... Like, this isn't to scale, but... Um, in the middle there, yeah, it's like a pit. Um, and then on the other side of that pit is a... Uh, See here is a little pedestal, oh. and on that pedestal oh. is a key. So yeah, you can look around. You can look around and see if you see any item. You know, like like look, look at certain things, stuff like that. I got some. Uh, what, what's the, what would that be a dexterity thing? There is no dexterity in this game. It would be athletics. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's no dexterity skill. Dexterity is a stat, but stats don't have inherent. It's, that's roles. what I mean. Yeah. It's, it's, it's a dexterity action, though. I, mean, I, I yeah. think athletics is probably better anyway. It's not like D and D where it's like you can just roll strength. You, the only skill roll, the only no, rolls I, are I, skills. I, I was saying it's, it's dexterity based, right? So I, I don't yeah. want to uh, yeah. figure it out. Yeah. Okay. I, 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 um, so yeah, uh, so you go in that room, you look around a little bit, let's go back to Ryan, uh, That's what are you doing, what are you doing right now? Looking for that, I'm perceptioning up, looking for that fucking... Are you, like, pushing any of the buttons, like, moving oh, gears, like, cause this, like I said, this looks like, this room looks like just like a giant, like, mist nightmare puzzle. Oh, I immediately started pushing every button I could. Okay, okay, so, um, one of the buttons you push eventually opens a little hatch, and the gear is in there. Oh, well that's... That was easy. Okay, yeah. I put I take the gear out and I put it in the, the hole. Okay. Um, you put the gear into like its its spot. Um, and yeah, it looks it fits perfectly. Okay. Cool. So do I you like? Okay. So yeah, you turn the wheel. Um, and the gears like turn, 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 and then behind you you hear like a <laughs> kind of noise. Um, and you turn around, and a panel has opened up, and in that panel is just like thirty buttons, just like in a push the fourteenth button. It lights up, nothing happens. I spell out. Uh, there's enough, is there enough buttons that I could like draw like a middle finger out of buttons? Probably, yeah. Okay, I would do that. Uh, you do that, um, and nothing happens. Actually, uh, you do that, and then like a uh, like a, a prompt message pops up in front of you, and says, uh, "That's not very nice." Oh, 
like a like those old like a like the old adventure games when you used to type in like the f word and stuff it would be like it would it would say something oh i got you okay well okay uh I, does it look like there's any kind of a weird pattern uh, that all of the buttons once i press them make that i could recreate on this that i'm looking for something like that um see here you look around and yeah you find what looks like um just like a drawing with like a bunch of dots like on and off and like okay, a pattern I'll do that. okay you do that to the buttons and uh to your right uh a keyboard pops out oh okay but it's just a uh, it's just a keyboard with the numbers from zero to nine. Oh, six nine four twenty. Nice. <laughs> uh, you type that in, and then like another prompt pops up, and it just says "nice." Oh, tight. Okay, cool. Uh, what's wait? Uh, what was this kid's birthday? I don't know. Uh. <laughs> oh shit! I, I thought I had them. I, maybe I don't have them in my notes. I don't. I don't. I don't we, remember. We asked because. At some point, we asked about this kid's birthday. Yeah, I didn't write it down. I don't remember. Uh, <laughs> I put in... Yeah. I'm going to put... Yeah. I'm going to... Oh, you know what? Wait a second. I got it. You know, just say you put it in his birthday. No, 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 no. Here's the number. I'm, what is it? Wait. I put in the date uh, 0424-83, which is, of course, the release date of the original Evil Dead. Whoa. Okay. Um... You do that, and um, below you, all of a sudden, uh, the 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 floor kind of lights up, and the the tiles in the ground are, are like kind of uh, blinking different colors and stuff like that, and like like in a pattern. Okay, I'd like to immediately uh, use my cyber deck to find like uh, I'm gonna go like fucking Ready Player One style here. I'm going to download into my head the uh, steps to Butterfly from Dance 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 Revolution 3rd Mix, because I'm pretty sure that's the code, and I'd like to perform that dance immediately, please. Thank you. What's, okay. What skill do I need for that? What skill role is that? You know what? I like that enough. I'm just going to give it to you. Thank you. <laughs> um, yeah. You, yeah, you, 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 got, you download, like, you find the, um, uh, like, the fucking Beat Mania step file or whatever. Um and download it into your your brain and perfectly do the steps um and you hear a ding and then um in front of you uh opens up another little panel and in that panel is just a bunch of knobs and switches this is the longest fucking puzzle of all okay time. so anyway no, no, so, no. I, I like it, but let's cut. Maybe go. No, back that's to what I was gonna say. That's what I was gonna say. Yeah, we cut. We cut back to uh, Nerdlinger, um, in that room, the the huge room with like the big pit that like you wouldn't be able to jump across or anything because it's like not so big. It. Oh, you can't jump it. No, it's so it's like that. That black drawing is not to scale. It's like huge. It's like a thirty, at least like thirty feet long. Like oh, I'd say thirty to fifty feet. Yeah, right, thirty forty feet. Yeah. I'd, like to use, I'd like to use my agent to immediately text Nerdlinger, do it pussy, but you won't. <laughs> I text him. How do you know where I am? Because I got eyes. Oh, no. Um, can I see the bottom of this pit? No. Ooh. It just looks like it just goes on. Uh, Let me see, can... see if you can hear the end. Yeah, yeah. Right. ooh, good plan. Yeah. Get, I'm find a get rock like a, or something. I don't know. Get the rug. Break something. Wait, wait, hold Talk on. I can give him a. I can give him a bullet. No, no, no. Use that rubber ducky. Yeah, get a rubber ducky. Oh okay. shit, yeah. You're exactly gonna be able to hear that though. It's soft. It'll squeak. Yeah, it'll squeak when it hits. Yeah. Really. Okay, so. Get the rubber ducky. Hmm. Back. All right, here you go, nerdlinger. Check that out. Thanks, Irving. <clears throat> Say goodbye. This is the last time you'll ever squeeze this ducky. R.I.P. Little guy. All right, and I toss it to its death. All right, you just kind of like you put your hand out just really dramatically with like the duck, uh, like open palm with the duck in your hand, and just kind of turn your hand over slowly, nice. and and let the uh, person with good hearing 
Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm a <clears throat> okay, and and you let it drop, and like a good, let's say like a good thirty seconds pass. Oh my god! And then Lily uh, just hears like a little. So there's a bomb, but it'll kill you. Thirty seconds is long, huh? Okay, we gotta do the math here. Terminal velocity on that thing's pretty pretty low though, so maybe it took a while. Oh, I I it's a portal. It's a portal to another planet. So we should all jump in, is what you're saying? Because it takes 30 seconds to get to Mars, right? Thank you. Oh. Thank you. No, that's not. What? 30 seconds to Mars. Immediately, <laughs> your room begins oh, start feeling. No, no. Immediately, the room that Ryan's in starts feeling with like nerve gas. Oh, and... no. <laughs> <clears throat> <laughs> no, no. Okay. <laughs> um. I rolled a 17 for perception. I don't know if that helps me figure it out. Um, with that, you look around the room, and um, you notice there's just like a couple, like in the corners, there's just like kind of a couple of piles of just like junk and stuff. And um, you're looking through them, and you find um, you find a, a bow and arrow. Is this some fucking, like, Last Crusade shit, like, the Leap of Faith or something? Mm. Or are you gonna make us some sort of road bridge? Yeah, yeah I mean, th know. this is an adventure game you're in, so... Yeah. What are you thinking? Do you have to, like, shoot an arrow and then yeah. catch it as it Well, I mean, nope. we haven't explored the dark room. I'm not sure if anyone wants to go feel around in there. Well, I'll come with. I'll go with you. Yeah. Feel on. I suppose, you know. suppose we could at least try. It didn't like uh, have any trap in it when I went in the first time, so. Alrighty. I'll look, I'll look from the outside. You two go walk around, I guess. Want me to, 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 to make some sort of roll to check the premises here? Uh, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm trying to think of which one that would be. Um, let's see. If not perception. It's under social skills. There it is. Awareness skills. What? There's two. Uh, oh, I'm, I'm sorry. I was looking at persuasion. Yeah. But. 19%. Oh, shit. Okay. With well, a 19. Um, just feeling around the walls. You're feeling around the walls, and you kind of just feel like a couple of little basic things, like a chair um, and like a small desk and a few little things like that. Um. And then kind of, the huh? Anything on the desk? Just um, yeah, yeah. You're feeling around, and yeah, like, uh, so on the desk, uh, you notice a book. All right. I just like a really old, read, read. leathery kind of book. Read from yeah, the book. I take that Necronomicon with me, assuming that's what it is. Okay. Uh, you, yeah, you take the book. You pick up the book. Anything else interesting that I found in the checker? Well, um, as soon as you pick up the book, uh, like almost like from nowhere, just like a gush, rush of wind, just like starts blowing in your face, just like seemingly from nowhere, and the room starts filling with like a red light, just like a bright light starts fill, like like lighting up the room. Um, oh, can, is it actually like visible now? Or is it yeah, it's visible now, and just yeah, everything is just bathed in just like a blood red light like a blood red glow um and it just gets brighter and brighter uh to the point where like it's just blinding um and then all of a sudden it just goes away and there are uh three kind of demons looking in the room and they're kind of angry looking oh all right so uh so i guess yeah like roll for uh, initiative Yeah. I'm stuck in that room. Yeah, yeah, he's stuck in that room. He can't. He can't be in the fight. Can't try to hack his way out. Nah. All right. You know, we cut uh, real quick. We cut back to Ryan. Um, hey, uh, oh, like Ryan doesn't know what's going on because he can't really. He he like the PDA, the PDAs aren't really letting you guys talk to each other. 
n- yeah. much. So like it's kind of static. You can't really talk. Um. Uh. So you like Ryan? Like Grant's here. All he hears or skip trace. All you hear is um. You s- suddenly you just hear like yeah all these kind of like kind of all these rustlings and stuff like that from out, from outside the room and uh and you're you're like another like five puzzles down the road at this point um I take my time i just want to make sure that we do all these puzzles correctly so no yeah no you've you've done like you've you've achieved like another like five or six puzzles in this room oh, in the time it, oh and it's so and no, like puzzles for me to actually figure out no there is um okay so you so you figured out like yeah like another you you're like another five or six steps into this thing, and okay. and you're like now, uh now they're uh like there's like a little tray, and there's five vials, and okay. they each have like a different colored liquid in them. Okay. And you're. Again. So like you're you're dealing so like it kind of cuts back to you and you're dealing with this thing, and all of a sudden here you hear kind of like a like a crashing and a boom. And like like all these kind of demony noise, and you kind of turn and you're just like, what the fuck was that? And you kind of, and then you turn back to like the chemicals or whatever it is. Okay. Um, what are the colors? Uh, red, orange, yellow, blue, green. What was the color of the rug when we came in? Um, green and uh, blue. Is that the rug that the actual uh, door was under, or the other rug? The other rug, because the other, the, the other, the other thing was just like a yellow. It was just a uh, uh, an old kind of yellowish uh, sheet. Okay, so hmm. is there any other? Is there are any of those colors of the vials anywhere in this room? Um. Wait. What? So the colors that you mentioned of the vials, if I look around the room, do I see those colors in this room I'm in right now? No. Okay. And the only other time I've seen those colors in this house is that rug? Yeah. Like distinctly, yeah. And you said the, the, the it was it was green and blue? Yeah. Green and blue down the hatch. <laughs> you drink them? <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah. Oh fuck. Okay. Um Wasn't that what I was supposed to do? <laughs> no. This is like a discovering your true potential type of thing, right? Um has to be. <laughs> you just immediately fall to the ground dead. No, no you don't. Yeah, you do. Uh, um you fall to the ground dead real. and you're you're um well in the VR, like you just fall to, like you lose control and you just kind of like fall to the ground dead. <clears throat> and your, the vision goes black, and then all of a sudden oh, your vision man. cuts back and you're standing up again. Fantastic! I'd like to load a save state from right before I did that. <laughs> well, it looks like you had like a you lo- like it, like you loaded like it looks like it had like another life or something like you kind of like re re okay. spawned or whatever. Well, I wasn't supposed to drink them. And and the liquids are back now. Well, what the fuck? That's what you do with liquids when you're in a dungeon. <laughs> You drink them. <laughs> Where else am I supposed to put them? <laughs> All right, I mix green and blue together. <laughs> uh, you mix them together, and um, you get like a new kind of sea foamy kind of color. Okay. And um, when you do that, um, uh, let's see here. And then I dump it on the floor. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Yeah. Why? Acid. Uh, I'm trying to. I'm. I'm. No, I don't do that. Okay. Um. Is there any sort of a receptacle that could? Yes. Take a liquid yes. Liquid? I was. Yes. I was about to say. There's like a little kind of. There we go. Like a little funnel. Oh, I'd like to. I'd like to also, for further uh, reasons, I'd like to palm one of those other colors and put it in my pocket. Nice. Okay. All right. All right. You do that. Uh, but anyway, I do that. Anyway, yeah. I, I take the sea foam and I. I put it into the spectrometer. Okay. Um, you pour it in there. A little light above the funnel kind of turns on, like green turns green. Uh-huh. Um, and then a uh, conveyor belt uh, pops out and rolls uh-huh. down uh, a bunch of uh, parts for like what looks like kind of like like a statue. 
Okay. It's like like a sil- it's like, fucking- All right, like a silver like monkey, monkey kind of. Alright, I like take the base. I take the one that looks like. <laughs> Uh, a square base. I put it. Uh, okay, you're you're uh, you start putting together the silver monkey. Uh, while you're doing uh, that, we cut uh, back to the other guys. Middle right. It's next to death scene. Oh, okay, I got it, I got it. Oh, yeah. shit, shit. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah. Alright. Do I'm typing all these down real quick. Um, probably, but I don't remember how to use it. Um, <laughs> so, it's just, let's just take a second for me to just type it down. Okay. So I got all your initiatives down. Let me roll. Um, let's see, let me bring to, to minus the stuff for me and Lily. Uh oh, okay. Does that automatically or no? Does uh it doesn't do it automatically? Okay. Um, that's kind of weird that it wouldn't, but um. Uh, I thought in the past we've done that. I don't know. We just five. Uh-huh. I'm not sure uh, if it matters for the sake of breaking a tiebreaker, but my bonus to my initiative is 10 for reflex. Oh, 10. Uh, you're talking about me, aren't you? Uh, yeah, you're, you beat me. Yeah, if you, if you hover over the numbers, you can see the bonus. Was six. Okay. Uh, so I got initiative. Okay. Um, so first up is uh, Zip. Okay. You said three demons, but do, and do they look all the same? Uh, they. Okay. So there's a. Um. I mean, you can. Like I like like it's just like yeah. You like you're standing where you are where like when like the demons appeared basically yeah. Um. So they're kind of. No, it like like the light has kind of gone to normal now in the room. And it's just th- there are three demons. So there's like uh, a red demon, an orange demon, and a uh, a yellow demon. Is it similar build? Yeah. Do they have all horns or how big are they? Uh, yeah, they got like horns. And they got like yeah, like claws. Right. I know anything. I know yellow is the most dangerous color. No, in here, blue, blue and green are the most dangerous, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> you guys don't know that? No, no. <laughs> oh, we don't. Oh, yeah, we don't know that. Okay. Uh, no matter where they are in this room, but my shotgun's basically ideal for this, and nobody's in the way, so I'm going to take the opportunity to pull that out and take a shot. Uh, I'll, I'll shoot the yellow one. I'm not, I can't see it on the map, so I'm just assuming. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah. I almost forgot. Let me get, like, a demon photo real quick. Just a demon, demon, demon. So I don't want to interrupt too much, but apparently the rest of our volumes on the stream is a little quiet compared to yours, Rob. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, let me. I need to, I need to check to see if I can fire twice or not, or how that works now. All right, go ahead and try that. Uh, speaking, test one, two, eight. Yeah. It's, Hello. Uh, it's, that's probably gonna be better. Well, just looking at the the eyeball on the levels, that looks better. Uh, yeah, cool. thank you, thank you, Zomner, for the tip. Uh... So now you can hear our voices and all our, or I guess their glories. I don't know. It wasn't worth it. All right. All right. Yeah, I got I got the demon photos here. <laughs> Let me uh pop these in here. Oh, what the heck? What the heck? Oh. Oh, uh, I'm excited! They backed out. We go back in. What do you think the... these demons are gonna look like, guys? Oh, there we go. Look nice. Oh, jeez. Oh, god. We're seeing behind the curtain here. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> That's what I was going to do. Oh. Oh, yeah, God. just got to give it a sec. Well, maybe okay. these demons are friendly. So, yeah, let me yeah. bring in... No such thing. Okay, what I got to bring in on this window. Okay, so I'm I'm, re- I'm re-remembering how... Uh... It's been a little bit. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> how Roll20 works. So let's see here. I got to bring him in to... Here, yeah, okay. So I got to bring him into this thingy, upload him here. Upload that demon. Bring out that demon. Yeah, mine, bring uh, out your demon. Yeah, upload. There we go. And then drop that file. It's uploading. It's uploading. Exciting. Uh, exciting. Secret. Exciting content. Uh, it's uploading. You can't see it. You know it. what? I'm pretty excited. Yeah. Um, I'm here for to fight some demons. Ta- or talk to demons. Uh, you don't know. I'm here to fight. Why do you want to fight your demons? Get rid of them. Okay, so. Kind of argument logic. Pretty, we, got, we got demons. Demon, demon, demon. <clears throat> Oop, demons. Didn't mean to draw. Oh, oh God. <laughs> Is that the demon? <laughs> yeah, these are the demons. Oh my god. Uh what let me let me see here. Let me try to This is an endorsement for roll twenty. I don't know what it is. <laughs> I'm trying to see is there a way to like highlight them with like different colors so I can let you know like Yeah. Oh, yeah, tint if color. There we go. Just... There we go. I found okay. it. How come I can't see the demons? Yeah, yeah no, he hasn't either. put them on yet. But they're on his stream. Because he's the DM. They should be on there. He hasn't, he hasn't displayed it to us yet. They're, they're only not... on your thing, they're not on our thing. Yeah, they're not on our questing uh, roll twenty pages. Maybe that's mm. the. Oh, maybe that's the thing. Is they're invisible and we can't see them. <laughs> invisible <laughs> demons. We have to scream. No, I mean dude. they should be there. That's weird. Yeah. I'm, I'm no, in dude, player I'm view you, right now. We're um... looking at it, and there's there are no demons. Yeah, that's mm. they're invisible. But I, can I move over it and see what happens? Just to... oh no, see the demons. Oh, I no. yeah, this is. Like roll twenty is like has it. some real demons. Like what's going on here? <laughs> <laughs> like this is freaking yeah, bizarre. I have never seen this happen well, before. In any case, in any case, I'm watching your stream, so I can see where they are. It's no big deal. Okay. Yeah. Technical issues aside, who cares? All right. Well, uh, this room's pretty small, right? Like that's only uh ten feet away, roughly. If these yeah. squares are five. Yeah. All yeah, right. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Then I, I will definitely take the opportunity to uh, line up a headshot and burn five luck points to counteract. Dang. Wow. Okay. So I'm aiming for the head for double damage. Yeah, there we go. Now we're talking. All right, and you, you add, said you were shooting five, for the uh, yellow one? Yeah. Okay. And, uh, um, I, I, well, actually, it's actually minus one from that for aiming for the head because I'm using five luck at the same time. Okay. Nice. Um, yeah, let's see here. Let me, let me roll. Tick-tock, tick-tock. Uh, Invisible demons. Okay, yeah, you you hit. All right, nice. Um, do you want me to roll damage twice or just roll damage once and double it? Um, I get, uh, roll 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 and then da- double it. Yeah. Thirty-six. Oh. Ooh. Okay. Um. So. <laughs> You aim for yellow demon demon's head. Um, <clears throat> you pull out your shotgun, and uh, yeah, you fucking obliterate it. It's fucking Jeez. destroyed. Um, do you want to do, do you want to do you want to do the honors of describing like the killing blow just because you just just like utterly destroyed it so much? Do it. I, I think I'd be a little bit surprised myself. I'd just uh, <laughs> be like, oh. Oh, oh. Uh, yeah, that happened. And I'll just shuffle over there. You next. <laughs> Shit, my God. Which color demon did he take out? Yellow. Yellow. The one that okay. I'm moving towards right now. I just shuffle out of the way so you guys have a clear, and that should be everything I can do in my turn. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah. Um. So, yeah, next up is uh, Nerdlinger. The nerd boy. Nerdlinger on deck. I'm going to step step to this corner here. Okay. 
take aim with my medium SMG at Mr. Orange over there. Okay. And I'm going to let him fly. And you oh, know what? I'm going to pump some luck points in, too. I'm going to pump in... I'm going to pump in four luck points. Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah. Four luck points. You know, we need to use our luck points a little bit more here. I feel like I never... I forgot about it completely. I'm just like, I, I'm going to use it for a head... Yeah, me too. And I totally forgot about it until you just used it, so... Here we go. So, plus four. Twenty. Okay. Hell yeah. Um, so that's, like, the total damage you do? That's the total attack. That's the hit. Okay, okay. Make him, oh, oh, that's the... Okay, that's right. You're rolling the hit. That's right. Yeah, so, whatever. Little. Plus four. Okay. Um... <laughs> <Are> you, <laughs> you doing, like, the... That was the Doug. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't... No, no, I wasn't even trying. I just, I just make weird noises like that when I'm thinking... Um, <laughs> oh, that's like totally the. Anyway. <laughs> we'll be right back. Yeah. Um. <laughs> yeah. Um. Okay. Yeah. Um. You hit him. You hit him. Sweet. And now for three bullets, is that three over whatever his uh DV or whatever demon's DV is? Three points over the DV. Uh, I think so. All right. I like those odds. Yeah. That means three rolls, three bullets right. for my SMG. Yes, okay, yes, here we yes. Go. Y'all ready for this? All right. We do a total of 15, 15 damage. Woo, 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 woo. Okay. All right. And let's see here. 15 damage. At least that much. Okay. All right. Um. So you don't kill uh orange demon, but uh you took you took a good chunk out of him. Nice. Um, Which chunk? He looks pretty beat up. Yeah, he looks he look he's looking a little haggard. Um, a little. Yeah, just a little haggard. Um, like he's kind of coughed up a, a little bit of blood. Um, but he Ooh. he seems like he's still kind of like ready to go a little bit. Okay, he's ready to go. Yeah, yeah. Lily's got to finish it. Or wait, wait, it's my right. turn. Uh, no. Uh, next up is uh the red demon. Yeah. All oh, right. Shit. All right. Um. Here we go. So let's see here. The red demon. Okay. It saw how uh how brutally uh Zip destroyed Yellow Demon. So it's so it's like kind of like dead on looking at looking at you coming at you. Um. And he comes in, and he kind of just takes his, like, razor-sharp claws and just kind of comes in for a swipe. So I guess, right. like, roll to see if you dodge that. I got. I have to roll evasion. This is the first time I've been swung on. All right. Save it. 24. I don't think you're going to hit me. Oh, That's shit. Yeah, one. you, uh, okay, so, yeah, oh, you man. you dodge it. Like, you want to, like, since that was so good, yeah, you want to describe how you dodged it? I, th yeah. I think as soon as he steps towards me i'm looking in his direction i just slide further into the wall and he just hits the wall behind me okay yeah okay cool so yeah that's what happens and yeah, um yeah. yeah he he whiffs his his uh his turn um so let's see here so that that would mean yeah he would kind of like go and kind of be right here right in my All face right. yeah um Stream to off burn a little bit. I guess. Stream is down. The stream is down. Uh oh. Stream down. Oh no. Stream up. Except I was just buffering a little bit. Okay. Yeah. I was gonna say. <laughs> um. Let's see where was. I? Okay. So yeah. Next up. Let's see here. Um. So yeah. The demon. Red demon whiffed its shot at an attack. So now it is Irving's turn. Okay. Um. What are we at with these demons? So the orange demon is like kind of damaged. The, the, the orange demon is like. Not on the ropes, but it's hurt. It's, um, and the yellow demon's hurt. obliterated. Right, what well, about gone, yeah. And the red demon right. hasn't been hurt yet. Yeah. Okay, then I want to attack the red demon because I'm maybe because uh, I'm a fighter, so I want to like take out whoever's you know still got the most stamina left. Yeah. So. Uh, okay. Let me move over to uh, where the red demon is. Okay. And I am just gonna straight up assault rifle it, and uh, so I just I just hit attack on the assault rifle. Um, I think so. 
Or do I need to? Well, I do oh, no, that you, first, and then yeah. What you you roll um, to need... see if you you hit first? Okay, all right. Yeah, yeah. So twenty one. Go twenty one. That's pretty good. Let's see though. Um. Um. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You you obliterate him. Um. Or you, you 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 definitely hit him. I should say you don't obliterate him yet. A solid. Um, but you do hit him. You you are going to make a solid connection. Um. So yeah. Roll for. Um, Obliteration. Yeah. Roll for for damage. For damage. Yeah. Carson did one for like every bullet, so I have to do that because it's an assault rifle. So it shoots like a ton of bullets. Should I just roll once. Or. Uh, you shoot three bullets out of an assault rifle, I believe. So you'd roll three times if if it's over three points, at least over the enemy's DV. All right. Does that sound right, Rob? Yeah, yeah. yeah. That sounds yeah. Okay. Three. All right. So fifteen, twenty-two, sixteen. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um. <laughs> so yeah, you pull out your assault rifle and you just spray and pray into this red demon like like you are just like the fucking doom guy right now just like rip and tear just just fucking going crazy on this dude just going fucking ballistic you ever Um, seen uh inglorious bastards it's like at the end when they shoot up hitler whoa spoilers (laughs) yeah (laughs) jeez oh man uh, Uh. Come on. Get him. Come on. Oh man, 12, wow. year, 12 year old 12 year old movie. Like don't <laughs> like I haven't seen Lincoln yet, so don't tell me about that. Um uh, and, so yeah, you're you like by the time you're done, it's just like red mist and guts. Just like there's just oh. nothing left. But I ran up to him. So am, I, am I covered in like, uh, like Yeah, and you're it was, yeah, it's just like you're covered in like Ash from Evil Dead, like cartoonish levels of blood. Yeah. Just yeah. Uh, groovy. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> groovy. All right. So now, yellow demon, red demon, or fucking Dunzos. Yeah, yeah. And the last one's pretty much close to death. Yeah. If He's he doesn't have a move, we might wipe him out without getting hit. I should well. get rid of him. Well, it's up to Lily, isn't it? Yeah, or her, or the demon, depending on. Yeah, is it my turn, Rob? <laughs> on the stream, you kind of like snuck out from behind the demon, like it's, like yeah. when you said that, that was pretty funny. <laughs> um, uh, yes. so let me move him out of the way. Um, since he's dead. Uh, yeah, no. yeah, it's uh, it's Lily's turn. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna shoot the last one with my uh very heavy pistol. All right. Okay. Okay. Okay, that's a hit. Okay, barely, but yeah, that's a hit. Oh. The heavy pistol probably shoots like one at a time, or yeah. Yeah. Okay, so thirteen damage. Okay, thirteen damage. Um. Plus, he's already like kind of. Uh, hurt so okay so yeah you hurt like so what what do you you just pull out your very heavy pistol and just kind of do you shoot at any particular part or anything like that or uh the head oh headshot okay so you aim for the head um and fire but uh you kind of you don't hit him like dead on you kind of go to the side you kind of like shoot his ear and like his horn kind of off a little bit, um, like you, like you get like a chunk of his head off though. Don't get me wrong, like it hurts. It hurts him real bad, um, yeah. and he is just like there's just like blood, just like like squirting. Yeah, like you can see, like a little bit of his brain kind yeah. of sticking out. Like he's just yeah. he's just barely, he's on the ropes. Yeah, yeah he's gotcha. like yeah. Put it back. Okay, um, so now it is the orange demon's turn. <laughs> Um, oh, what's he going to do? He kind of, like, at this point, he's, like, just kind of staggering around the room, 
just kind of just like just how's how's how far is that blood squirting is it like getting everyone else dirty in the room or is it just like oh yeah 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 it's it's like yeah it's like a it's like a three stooges bit but with like blood like yeah it's just (laughs) everyone's getting splattered yeah yeah um Um, so yeah he's like yeah kind of stumbling around and uh goes up to lily and sort of just kind of stumbles and falls forward. So his attack essentially is going to be him to like falling on you. Ooh. Um. So yeah, I guess uh, roll an evasion. Nice. Sixteen. Okay. Let me roll. Okay. Okay. Um. So yeah, um, the demon is like kind of yeah, just stumbling, stumbling, and then kind of like, kind of like uh, trips up on its own feet, kind of trips on its own feet, and kind of lump, slowly, kind of like almost like when you chop down a tree, just kind of uh, almost in slow motion, kind of falls forward, and as it's doing that, Lily like kind of jumps and rolls out of the way, like does like a dive roll out of the way, and the demon kind of like slams into the ground. And it actually takes a little bit of damage, but it's not quite dead yet. It's just cling it's clinging on for dear life though. Oh man. This poor demon. It's just it's just laying there on the like face down on the ground, just kind of Oh man. Just kind of gr- grumbling. Its Shot its horn off. Alive. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. And there. it is now Zip's turn again. We we've uh, gone all the way around. Or oh, back for the background. Yep, yep. All right. Well. Uh, oh yeah. So it fall. It falls where Lily was. So yeah, it's like kind of about right there. I feel bad. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Not I suppose. I mean, I'll. I'll uh, just take a melee attack since it, I think it'll be easier to hit. I won't bother using another shell because I don't want to blast somebody or ricochet. Mm-hmm. That's, that's very responsible. I appreciate mm-hmm. it. I'm, think, I'm thinking in universe. Yeah. All right, here it goes. Yeah. Twenty. Oh. Okay. <laughs> um. But, let's but see. It's tonight. Yeah. yeah. No kidding. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um. Yeah. You. You. Uh. What's? This is the killing blow. So what do you do? All right. Well, this is with Ripper. So I imagine I'm just gonna gouge the back of the skull and just plunge it in there and just end it real quick. Okay. Yeah, honestly, you could have just, like... Curiosity. Let's see what the damage was. 12. Yeah, he's... That's max damage, too. Holy shit. That's... Yeah, you you tend to, like, just kind of... You you try to give him, like, like a little mercy kill, and it just just ends up just, like, eviscerating his whole, like, kind of back and part of his head, and... That shreds his head up. Yeah. Just make a bowl out of it. Yeah. I'm like, I'm like Lenny and the rabbits. I'm like, I'm trying to be nice. Uh, so, <laughs> <the> rabbits, <George. laughs> oh man, I'm mice and men. So you kill, you kill the three demons, and as soon as the third demon has lost its last uh, hit point, they all three of them kind of like, all three of their corpses kind of start flashing, and disappear. Um, and then uh, above you, from the ceiling, uh, you see like a, almost like a spotlight, and from the spotlight floating down uh in front of you is a key oh. excellent you have Got solved it. my demon puzzle <laughs> by blasting them all right we made a big mess but we did it yeah yeah speaking of big mess i'm gonna try to clean up a little bit but <laughs> there's a bathroom so oh, yeah. all right yeah. so you guys are have just defeated the demons and gotten the key and while you're cleaning up, we cut back to Ryan, who again what? has like gotten like another six or seven puzzles down the road at this point. <laughs> like like steps in this puzzle or whatever. So where am I at? Right now, uh, hanging from the ceiling are a series of uh, uh, balance, like weight balances and stuff like that, and and and, a, and there's a big tray of weights. Uh, and like a little arrow kind of in the middle of the weights like in the, in the middle of the weighing thing that kind of points yeah. in different directions okay 
Uh, do you have a visual representation of this? Or do um, like yeah, here I can I can make a little drawing of it real quick. Yeah. Um, so it would like here's like this like a scale, mm -hmm. like that, and then in the middle it's kind of like a little arrow, kind of like pointing in a direction. Which direction is it pointing? It's just kind of pointing straight up. Oh, so they're even right now. Yeah. Okay. Well, then I did it, right? Because they're even. <laughs> no, the, it's, it, there's nothing on it right now. Those are just like little little trays on the left and right side of it. Oh, oh got it. Okay, well, you made yeah. one bigger than the other. Yeah, yeah I didn't uh, mean to. Okay. Yeah. So what, what, uh, okay, so I look at the weights that I could put on it. Mm -hmm. what, what, uh, what kind of weights are we dealing with here? You have uh, three five weight uh, pounds and two ten weight pounds. So three fives and two tens. Uh huh. There's no way to split thirty-five evenly. So oh, no, that ends. Uh, <laughs> I put a ten and a five on each side, and then I take the the last five and I put it directly in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> What? <laughs> I don't know why that's so funny to me. <laughs> Dude, I'm trying to think of this like an actual puzzle and not something you're definitely making up as you go along. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, you put the other weights on like the left and right sides on it and kind of nothing happens. But then as soon as you put a weight on the middle of it, uh, the, uh, weight, the, the scale starts glowing and you hear a ding. Um... <laughs> I don't know. Uh, and then uh, um, above you from the ceiling uh, descends uh -huh. uh, a, uh, oh, a dog. Oh, oh shit. All right. I fight the dog. Yeah, I just, fight the, the demon dog. Descends. No, no. Descends a, uh, a model of the uh, solar, a solar system model. Oh, oh, fucking okay. <laughs> yeah, All right. Well, um, the clue about the dog barking makes me want to immediately look at Pluto. <laughs> the clue. Yeah, <laughs> the clue. Check Pluto. Yeah. yeah, check out the Pluto. Check out Pluto. Okay, you look at Pluto. Um, yeah, it's like a small ass little ball. Okay, crush it. <laughs> no. Oh. Um, well, Pluto's not a planet, so we're safe. Yeah, you, you, yeah, you're, yeah. How you're, dare you? How dare you? You crush, crush it, it no, uh, nothing happens, yeah. Okay. Uh, I line up, I, I'd like to line up all the planets into a syzygy. I don't know what that is, but you do that. That means um. when all the planets <laughs> align. That means when all the planets align in a row. Oh, okay. Um, you do that. And uh, nothing happens. Okay. Do any of these planets look out of place? Like, is there a Neptune where a where a where a Mercury should be, or anything like that? Um, I mean, it seems uh relatively accurate, like not to scale, but you know, accurate okay. and order and stuff. You should look at uh, your favorite band's planet. Blink one doesn't have a planet. God damn it. Man, what was the band we talked about earlier? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'd like to spend 30 seconds looking at Mars. <laughs> okay. You stare intently, just like laser beam just detection, just like uh, locked on Mars. Um, oh. And you start a timer on your PA for exactly 30 seconds. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, and you're just staring at it and staring at it. And staring at it, and then your your phone goes beep 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 beep. The thirty seconds are up, and then all of a sudden, from the ceiling, descends another monitor. Uh, and Jared Leto says, "You found the Easter egg. Congratulations!" <laughs> oh, perfect. Oh, cool. What do I get? That you, you get to see. You just get to see the video of. 
Jared Leto saying congratulations you found the Easter right, egg. It's just a pre-recorded oh, video. It's not like Oh, it's not. You know. okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah, the the video. Like, all I, right. I, I don't know enough about 30 Seconds to Mars to make a joke about it. Literally, all I know Except... about 30 Seconds to Mars is that Jared Leto is in it. Same, yeah. <laughs> like... uh, okay, I, I'll go back to the model then. And uh, what if we... Does it look like I can take the planets off of the model and, like, switch them around? No, but it looks like you can kind of, like, swing them around a little bit and, like, change. Yeah. Okay uh let's let's uh let's start with mercury and see if it feels like a combination lock like i'm just going to rotate it around the sun and see if i feel like a little click or anything okay yeah you start moving it and yeah sure enough you you feel it kind of like clicking into place like every couple inches or so oh so there's more than one click feeling yeah like it's like it's oh. like it's like it's yeah, it's almost like there's kind of like little little spots each like that it can like like kind of like when you shift a car like there's little got it things that can when move. I move Mercury does anything else move or is Mercury the only thing that moves? Um yeah, it looks like it's the only one that moves. Okay. I don't fucking know what to do here, man. Um, I will move. If I just start spinning things around. Does anything happen on like the monitors or anything? Like, is 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 me moving the the planets having any effect on anything else in the room? Okay, so you start moving it around while looking around the screen, the room, and you do notice like a monitor that kind of has like uh like a circle on it mm -hmm. and uh a line kind of diagonally, and then like another little smaller dot that's kind of like on the edge of that circle. Uh, that's okay. kind of that's kind of moving with the uh, I'd like to planet. try to rotate the planets to line that all up. Okay, you you line up the planets like with that kind of diagonal line and you hear um a ding and a uh like an old, like a, like one of the walls, like the back wall, the short, the shortest wall, kind of lifts up, and out from the wall comes like an old looking like piratey organ with like bones and stuff all over it, oh, and like really really old looking sheet music. Nice. Here we go. <laughs> So, uh, as that happens, I, like let's cut back to the other guys. Uh, you've just oh, I'd finished. Like to immediately start, I'd like to immediately start playing "Up in the Air," which is the top one of the top ten thirty second to Mars songs. Nice. See what that does. Is that okay. What um, oh, I just look. <laughs> okay, so yeah, you follow like the yeah you follow the the fucking MIDI file you find for that or whatever. <laughs> yeah, not and... not the music on the actual thing. I just would like to start playing. Uh, what's their I don't know any of these songs, man. Uh, the kill is think there's like the yeah, first one they yeah. got. Yeah, that's the shining song. I'm done yeah. with this 30 second of Mars joke. Fucking um, let's move on. I'll come back to it. Okay. Uh, from I from yesterday. Even, I don't even like 30 seconds from Mars. I used this. to. <laughs> oh, Lily Live knows it all. Whoa! Yeah. No, I think I think no, I think Crystal is saying she likes they, 30 seconds of Mars. One of the same. Oh, got it. <laughs> Are the same goddamn it. Maybe you could use their help. What was that show he was on? Which Suicide one? Suicide Squad. Oh, the one he was young? Yeah. Uh oh, I don't know. Claire Danes was in it too. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. What the fuck is that show called? I'm gonna try playing the theme song to that show, but after you come back to me. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Go ahead. Okay, so yeah. Uh, my guys... so called life. It's called my so called mm, life. Yeah. <laughs> So you guys are just about done cl cleaning up the blood, and uh, and so yeah, you you like you just yeah you just finished cleaning up the blood. So what do you what do you do next? Like do you? I didn't I didn't clean myself off. I think the bath the stuff in the bathroom looks dirtier than what's on me. So I'm just not <laughs> cleaning it up. Okay. Um. So right. it looks like Nerdlinger went went back into the the pit room. Yeah, Ner Nerdlinger wants that damn that key. One. I got my eye on the prize. I was muted. Prize, uh, the key. We never opened up the book. Oh, hey, buddy. Whoa. Hey, hey, Kuma. There was Wait, a, we got book? a book? 
Didn't, yeah, didn't the, the, the demon book. Oh, didn't the demon oh, the, come the, out the after we opened the book? No, I was just yeah. holding it. I oh. never opened it. I think oh, that yeah. you you picking the book up is what summoned the demons. Yeah, yeah. that's what I'm saying. We never look at it. Oh, all right. Uh, out in the hallway with more light, I want to take a look at the book and see what it's all about. All right, you open up the book, and inside, uh, someone has like cut out like the pages to make like a, a secret hiding spot. And oh, in the book, excuse me, is uh, a chicken with uh, a pulley in a the chick. middle, a rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. Well, you know what you gotta do. Yeah. There. Toss the chicken into the pit. No. Nah. No. <laughs> hey, we gotta investigate. All right. Well, I guess pull the pulley on the chicken for sure. All right. Okay, um, you kind of spin the pulley or whatever. Which 30 Seconds to Mars song does it play? <laughs> you kind of spin the pulley on it and, like, nothing happens. Oh, oh. damn it. Uh, th- throw it in the trash. No. Like, I mean, it spins it. freely. Like it, like, it seems pretty strong and, like, well-built. Um, but, yeah. like it Wait. It, how, how long is this pulley? Like, you, well, like it's just like, um, it's like a four-inch circular pulley. Okay. Uh, like between well. the legs of like a rubber chicken. Wait, it's a pulley in between the legs of a rubber chicken. Yeah. And when you pull it, nothing, no song plays. No, it just, it just, it's a pulley, so it's like spins. Like you can put, like you know, like like a pulley that you put like a rope on and like. Yeah, I know. see where this is going. Yeah, yeah. I see yeah. where this is going. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, in this junk room, is there a rope? Um, I'd say you need to roll. What, what would you, what would that be? Um, perception. Yeah, perception. Roll perception. This boy is gonna roll per six. Mm, very, very. Yeah, nice. baby. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. <laughs> With that, uh, I mean, I'll tell you just like a couple of basic things. Like, sure. You see just like a pile of junk. Nice. Um, and then you see like a really old looking computer from like this the late seventies with like a ton oh, of wires right. and, and stuff. Or the corporate war. Yeah, yeah. Um yeah, there's nothing Which in here. War? The Me the corporate war. Yeah. yeah. Well there's before. four of them. Be before all of them. Yeah. Oh god. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Before, yeah. Yeah. Uh yeah, nothing in here. Um, there's a computer. Do you guys like computers? I know someone likes computers. Like, like it looks computers. like like you look at the you look at the computer and it looks like the computer and the tower have like kind of like some smoke damage kind of look into them as if they'd been like right, fried yeah. and looks like they probably won't work. They're like the like those white plastic computers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah okay, all right. No, nah, it's, it's garbage. But there's a bunch Fresh. of wires and yeah, there's just like just like. Like, there's all like just like a giant switchboard with like t- hundreds of just like wires and stuff kind of coming out of it and going to the computer. Rob, do you want me to use the wires? Huh? <laughs> do you want me to use the wires? I don't know. I'm just describing like it's just like there's right. a there is a. I'm gonna start pulling out these wires. Wait, there is a surprisingly a, a a number of wires here. <laughs> for, so for the many wires. <laughs> Wait, we oh. can attach them to the bow and then shoot them. Yeah, so yeah. I've been thinking. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> you, you give that a I shot. I mean, even if they're short, hey, you, you, know, could t- you could tie all the wires together. I know, I know. It's just that's like, yeah, that's where Rob's pushing me. <laughs> yeah, you know what? Let's uh, start pulling out these. Oh, there's so many wires. <laughs> what were computers like before the war? My God. We need to shoot the bow and arrow because I have a. It's before they invented wireless. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. God, life was awful back then. Yeah, everything had to be connected to everything. <laughs> exactly. I'm going to start uh, knotting these wires together. All right. Um, so, yeah, you're tying the wires together. And uh, what's everyone else doing? What? Uh, that Will they have the I got the, I got the pulley. What? What? Do we have anything we think we need for this chasm? Maybe like a clip or something, like a belt. I don't know. Well, if we shoot the bow, I'm assuming there's something we can stick it in or like... Uh, Wrap like, it around on the other side, like the the wall oh. on the other side. Look, look, like you, like you might be able to hit that. Well, or alternatively, hmm. 
we don't even need to get to the other side. We just need to somehow the get the key and then pull it back. You're playing a dangerous game because it might I, dock the key into the pit. Mm. That's fine. I'm willing to risk that. Oh yeah, God, you might not be us. Us one of the bird linger. You know? Huh? Huh? Oh, yeah, give it a nah, shot. Give it a I'm, shot. I'm, well, yeah. I'm just tying these damn wires. All right. Um. So yeah, you... who's gonna shoot though? That's you, bud. Okay. You get you get the best marksmanship, don't you? Yeah, marksmanship. Yeah. All right. So I'll I'll head over there. All right. All right. So at this point, I'd say you got like you've got enough tied together to like make the length of the room. Man, these smoke damaged wires better <laughs> better hold tight. Hold tight. <laughs> yeah. All right. So I'm shooting at the key. That's our plan, Mister Nerdlinger. Um. Well, where's the pulley coming to play here? I'm assuming that's a anchor on one side. But I yeah. I don't know what we'd secure it to. On well, on your side of the uh, chasm, uh, there's a like really big like attached to the wall like coat rack <laughs> nice. All right. and then on the other side of the room is like a couple of like marble statues I don't trust okay. that let's put the pulley yeah. on the coat rack okay well no the pulley would, would uh, go on to the, the string and then you would presumably use that to go over to the other side oh boy oh. why would the chicken cross the road God damn it! Uh, oh, climb across. I see. Well, <laughs> you, you don't. You don't think these old ass wires are not going to snap on us? Well, you know, I'm pretty confident. All right, I'll shoot, but I don't know who's lightest out of all of us. Probably really? not me. I, I I would have to take off all my guns and stuff to maybe I could be pretty late. I'm pretty lanky. No, Lily, how, how are you feeling? You willing to die? In VR? Uh, yeah, you know what? I'll do it. The climb? All right. So I'll shoot, and then Lily will climb. Assuming I make Well, you found shot. out. Well, I, I guess... Well, I, technically, I guess you guys haven't found out, because you didn't see Ryan, like, kill himself earlier. Um, <laughs> yeah, you guys yeah, don't you know guys about that. Lives. Yeah. But you guys don't know about yeah, that. Yeah, I don't know what he's doing in there. Yeah. Well, I just I, feel I, like it's... <laughs> it's no matter game. <laughs> so, yeah. All right, so you guys set up this pulley situation, and let me know when you're ready for me to shoot this thing off. I still don't know exact mechanism we're going for, but I offer the rubber chicken to anyone who wants to <laughs> place it. Yeah, put the pulley on on the string. Okay. Load her up. All right, so I'm. What am I aiming for? The key? Um, no. A, a secure point for uh, us to be able to All climb right. across it. So the the side of the key then, uh, the wall like a wall space. Yeah. What? Like on the wall, like uh, lodge into the wall, I assume. All right, so I'm just aiming for the wall. Okay. You got this. All right. Oh God. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, oh no. <laughs> get out of there! Know. Get out of there! Oh. oh I, 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 I misread where the lines were. <laughs> I thought it was like okay. Never mind. <laughs> All right, I'm safe. I'm safe. You guys pulled me back before I took my second step over. <laughs> Irving, no. <laughs> okay. Or like, no, this is in VR, so you like cartoonishly like stepped out above it and just kind of floated there for a second. Oh, Looney Tunes um, style. Yeah, yeah. And then like, as soon as you realized, you like started to fall, but then they grabbed you and pulled you back. <laughs> okay. All right, I'm back. Okay, we got that pulley and string situation set up. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to aim to the left of the key, right across from where I am, across the pit, and I'm going to shoot this bow and arrow. Y'all ready for this? I'm ready. All right. Three, two, one. 18 marksmanship. Ooh, okay. Um, With an 18, I would say, yeah, you you uh hit exactly where you were aiming. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, we did it, guys. We got a whole... Got a whole uh, knot of wires <laughs> that are leading us there. All right, Lily, Lily is up. She's got to crawl across now. Okay, what do I roll for this? Um, is there some sort of like acrobatics or something like that? Athletic. Athletics. There we go. Yeah. 
Okay, athletic. So what are you what are you trying to attempt specifically? Uh, I'm going to try to climb across using the wire. Uh, you're just going to... Like monkey bar style. Monkey bars. Okay. I think you should... Or, about the, should or you can tight rope it. Yeah. I mean, what would be safer? If you tight rope it, you might be able to grab it if you slip. That's what I'm thinking. Okay, Whoa. well, then I do that. Well, no, that's what the that's what the chicken pulley's for. Oh, I see, I see, I see, I see. Oh, I was thinking she'd like you know cross her legs over the top and then like upside down oh pull God. herself across. We all we all got a different image. Yeah, <laughs> we all got a different yeah. Right, here, yeah, let me, I'll, let me I'll draw it here real quick. Um, so yeah, just imagine yeah. Here's like this is gonna be a god awful drawing, but um, I can't wait. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> is that the chicken? <laughs> yeah, it's like the rubber, like you know, you know what a rubber chicken looks like. That that kind of a. Yeah. Gotcha. Oh yeah. my gosh! Like, little gobble gobble Very gobble little. rubber chicken. Yeah. Um, little, little chickadee. And then between the legs is just yeah, just like a pulley. It's like, yeah. That's true. It's like you'd use that yeah. to like kind of zip line across. Oh, you think you thread it through? Okay. Oh no, no, like a pulley is like kinda like a wheel. Yeah, it's like a wheel with like a groove in it. Yeah, that you would fit like a string or a rope in it. So right. like, like a zip line. Like a zip line. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. that, yeah. Whatever you guys want to do. Zip line. Right. So how, how how does she fare with a fifteen if she already rolled for it? Um. Well. Uh. So you hand her the chicken with a pulley, a rubber chicken with a pulley. Um. She kind of swings it over the the cables and kind of holds on, and gets like just like a little bit of a running start and runs out, and kind of glides across the chasm, and oh, nice. successfully jumps down. By the key. Ooh. All right. Nice landing. I take Thanks. the key. Okay, you grab the key, and as soon as you grab the key, uh, the room starts to kind of rumble a little bit. Oh, um, oh shoot. And then you look, everyone, you start hearing like a no, like the rumbling is specifically coming from the chasm. Um, oh. And as everyone's looking That's at the, the chasm. Rubber, uh, you can see like the ground kind of coming up and filling in the oh. chasm's hole. So now it's just like uh, one flat ground now. Oh. So now you can just walk freely nice. from one side of the room to the other. Is the duck back? <laughs> is the what? Yeah, where's my duck? The duck. Where's oh yeah, the, the yeah. And as the, when the when the floor comes <laughs> up and <laughs> clicks in, and yeah, you can see like the little rubber duck laying in the middle. Oh nice. thank God! I was worried. All right. Well, I am for one am impressed with these uh, old smoke damaged wires. So that's that's two keys so far, right? Yep, you got two oh, keys. Got two. All right, you gotta bang on Ryan's door and wake him up. All right, so knock. <laughs> all right, knock knock, Mister Skip Trace. What are you doing in there for so long? About puzzle number eighty-seven. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh shit! Am I oh, still at God. this piano, or have I moved past the piano? Uh, no, you figured out the piano. It turns what out... Was the, what was the piano thing? Uh, you had to play the music from Big. Like the... <laughs> that they do with, like... So you had to play Chopsticks. Yeah, sure. Um, okay. <laughs> so you did that, and then the, uh, piano, like, kind of swiveled around, like, like a... Like when a, um... Like when, like, a, a, a bookcase kind of swivels around for, like, a secret passage. Uh -huh. Like, it, it swivels around... And on the other side of like behind the uh, the organ is a bunch of uh, pieces of rope uh, coming oh, out of God. holes. Oh man! Like okay. ten ten pieces of like two uh, two rows five columns of rope. Full number six and nine. Holes. You pull them out and you just hear, uh, just kind of echoing around the room. Just nice. Okay, tight. Uh, Drink the rope. Th are they all the same? Are they all the same length? Yeah, they're all the same length, and they're all just kind of just 
regular white kind of rope. All right. Uh, okay. Uh, I, uh, I'd like to uh, let's see here. I'd like to tie them all together and then pull them all simultaneously. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> Ooh, okay. Uh, so, yeah, you tie them all together and pull them all at once and just like a cacophony of sounds just come out of it. Um, oh, okay, hold on. It's making noises. Okay, I didn't get that before. Tight. Undo it. Okay. Uh, and I'd like to uh, play... Uh, okay, so wait. Let me let me hit each one in a row, and you tell me the sound. Like, what notes do they make? They don't make notes. They make like different sound effects. Oh, okay. Well, let's. Uh, you better have those on hand. So <laughs> let's go through them all. What's uh? What's the first sound effect? Got to find a soundboard. Hey. <laughs> Number two. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Three. Yeah. Four. Moo. Nice. Wait, I'm writing these down. These are important. <laughs> hey, cool. Yeah, moo. What's number five? Whoa. Yeah, moo. <laughs> Whoa. What's number six? <laughs> wow. What's number seven? <laughs> oh, no. What's number eight? <laughs> nice. Uh, what's number nine? <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. And what's number ten? <laughs> ah! Oh. All right. Kind of like number five. Mm. Let's see here. Well, the only ones that I see that... Okay. Wait a minute. One second here. One second here. Oh. Brain blast. <laughs> yeah, you gotta, you gotta do your brain blast. He's, he's, he's figuring out the puzzle. <laughs> gotta do like an x ray zoom in through his ear and see like his pulsing brain. <laughs> Watch like formulas floating around and stuff. <laughs> yeah, a bunch of different algebra formulas are just like, zooming around. Uh, What's that song that goes like, hey, hey, you, you, you. Uh, get, in, get, get out of your dreams in my car. <laughs> yeah, okay, that's exactly what I thought it was. So uh, I, I pull the hey, the you, and then I scream, get out of my dreams, get into my car, and then what happens? It like, you hear it like almost ding, but then it goes, Err. oh, fuck, oh, okay. Know. So you kind of messed up the lyrics a little. Oh, what? <laughs> oh no. Uh-oh. Uh, okay. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I just think it's the Avril Lavigne. Uh. <laughs> They're both basically the same thing, if you think about it. Wait, yeah. Avril Lavigne's got a song like that? Hey, hey, yeah. you, you. Oh, I don't like your boy. That's That's pink, isn't it? No, no. no. Hey, hey, Canadian you, punk you. rock girl of the century. Get into my car. Uh, okay, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna pull Oops. the. I'm gonna yell, "Bop it!" And then I'm gonna wait five seconds, which would be too long, and I'm gonna pull the one that goes "Ah!" Which is like <laughs> what would go wrong when a when you lose on a bop it. What does that do? Okay, um, you do that. Um, you hear a ding, and then um, a little pan, like a little kind of secret latch, kind of like pops down. Okay. And in in the kind of the cubby hole is a boppet. Uh-huh. Nice. Okay. All right. Now it's time to use the skill concentration oh, fuck. to see how well I how many rounds I get on the boppet. So let me roll that. I'm gonna use two points of luck. Okay. Nice. Okay. Whoa, there you go. Dang. Ooh, okay. So you're like really concentrating on this bop it. Yeah. Oh man. He, he he he's on like round seventeen of bop it. Bop it, twist it, pull it. Woo, woo, woo. Yeah. Alright, what happens? Uh you're just playing that for like a really long time. So while you're playing that, what are you what are the other guys doing? 
hate this so much. I'm just right outside the door listening to all this bop and action. I'm like, oh my god. Yeah, he's, right. like, he's like bop a champion in there. I'm gonna go check on the latch that we found with the three uh, three padlocks and see if the keys we have fit it. Okay. Just, um... gonna, just to satisfy my curiosity. I'm assuming they do, but I just want to pop one in there and see if it unlocks. Uh, yeah, and as a matter of fact, it looks like they're kind of color coordinated so yeah you use two you match oh, up to the okay. keys and yeah they they fit perfectly nice well, this guy's just gotta bop his way to the third key and we'll be good <laughs> <laughs> all right come back to me what's going on we're playing games in there you're like <laughs> s- sweating up a storm like you're at like round like 30 40 of like okay <laughs> like you got like yeah like 40 commands coming at you each round all right it's nuts Nuts. Nuts. Okay, I'm just keep doing it until something happens. Yeah. All right. So yeah, while he's doing that, what are you guys doing? He's bopping. I'm gonna knock on the door and be like, "Is everything okay in there?" <laughs> I think this is hell. Um, you try opening the door. Let's bop it. I can't. I'm bopping it, I'm and coming I lose in. my concentration bopping when he does it. The, door, the, the door's locked. You can't come in. Um, I lose my concentration and it and it and it fails. What happens? Um. Well, just before you lose your concentration, you get to round one hundred. I get what? You get well. You just before you lose up. your concentration, you get to round one hundred. And... You break it up. I can't. He's breaking up. I can't hear him. Always oh, at the very same spot. Maybe. <laughs> Once yeah, no. you you start to lose your concentration, but uh, before you completely lose your concentration. You get to round one hundred and complete it. Hey, great. And it said, and then all of a sudden it says, "Pass it." <laughs> oh, oh no! I throw it in the air, and then I uh, catch it in another position because I'm hoping it doesn't know it's me. Uh-huh. What right. happens? Um, it starts just giving commands again. I immediately smash it. <laughs> You smash it, and then uh, you hear a ding. <laughs> um, and then inside the uh, bop it, smashed bop inside it. the smashed bop it is um, what is inside of it? It's a a smaller, uh, <laughs> a smaller bop it. <laughs> You're about yeah, three man. seconds from me using the game to break this game, <laughs> Rob. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, they make those keychain boppers. <laughs> keychain So what yeah, are we doing here, man? <laughs> what are you doing? It's up to you. What was inside? Uh, um, like, like I said, a smaller poppet. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm using my interface skill to fucking break this programming. Okay. You 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 did it, Rob. You broke me. I played your dumb game for 48 rounds. All right, yeah. Go ahead. Interface 15. Okay. Let me see. He's bopped out. <laughs> He's bopped out. Well, bopped okay. Out. Um. Uh, with that interface uh, roll, that's high enough to get in, and as soon as you get in, um, you hear like you hear just like one loud, like echoing, ding, oh. and then one more um, panel opens up and the key is in there. Nice. I want to look at the source code. How many more puzzles would I was, was I gonna have to do to actually fucking unlock this thing? It looked like it looks like the computer was just every time you solved a puzzle, it was randomly generating another puzzle, and it would have just kept going forever. Oh man, I hate this! All right, is the door unlocked? <laughs> and the door unlocks. Yeah. All right, I grab the key, I walk out. Right. Who? Okay, I don't want to save this guy anymore. This guy's a dickhole. Hey, what'd you do in there, bud? What was going on? <laughs> I don't know. Hey, nerdlinger, did you guys uh, get the other keys? Yeah, we uh, we've been sent here. Okay. <laughs> Did you guys get your inoculation though? Or what? You're inoculated, right? To the virus that they've been spreading the the fucking oh. gas that they've been spreading in here the whole time. <laughs> they've been doing that. Oh, I'm still cu- Yeah, okay. Here. And I take that vi- I take that vial and mm-hmm. I hand it to Nerdlinger. I was like, "Just drink this right now. You'll be fine." And <sighs> I'd like to roll persuasion using all my remaining luck. <laughs> okay. 
So that's a twenty. Okay. Uh, so so I'm not sure what he rolls to contest. He your would persuasion. roll human perception. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I just I wouldn't. Okay. Well, yeah. <laughs> just right. drink that. I mean, I wouldn't drink it. I, I told well, you. you got you got to roll. Yeah, the roll that for see if he persuaded you. All right. I guess we'll do PC to PC roll check. Um. There you go. Fantastic. Oh. <laughs> You're like, oh, he, okay, so yeah, Skip Chase is like, here, drink this. And Nerdlinger's like, well, can't argue with that. And just takes it out of your hand and drinks it. Which um, color is he drinking? Yeah, which all color? All the you... other ones. Oh. Okay, you mixed all the other colors. Okay, so you mixed everything except No, for... I, I took all the other ones, so I hand, I'll hand him the, I don't remember colors. I'll hand him yellow. Okay, so you hand him yellow. Um. <laughs> And he drinks it, and it's lemonade flavored. Oh fuck you, Rob! <laughs> this is really good. Thanks, man. You guys want some? Pass that around. I'm logging yeah, out of this. You, you know what? Fuck this. I'm logging out of this program. <laughs> I wouldn't go you out there into the real world. You couldn't just let me have this one thing, Rob. You couldn't let me just. <laughs> hey, I, 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 you're you're the hacker. I was like, I was expecting like, hey, you want to hack? You told me that you didn't like that I was hacking your games anymore. I didn't, didn't say that. I was trying to play along. I didn't. No, nah, I, I, I said, hey, you're a hacker. You can hack. Yeah. <sighs> he was going to let you punch a hole in the door, and he just said that wouldn't do anything for you. I, true. It's true. Let's just get this over with. <laughs> <laughs> just going to the basement. All right. Hey, Skip, I appreciate the lemonade. It was really good. It was poison. I was trying to kill you, and then I opened the door. I opened the lock and walked downstairs. Why would you want to kill your friend? <laughs> All right. Um, uh, let's see here. So you open you open the uh, latch and go downstairs. Um, and, yeah, it's just kind of a – you you. there's no lights on, so there's just kind of all darkness. Um, but there's kind of like one of those like hanging from the ceiling is like a light bulb with like a pull string like uh, uh, switch. Right. Oh, I'll pull first. a light switch. I'll pull it. Right. Want me to go down first? I'll go down first. Yeah, I think I, I think Skip Trace down. went down first. I went down. I didn't even give a shit. I just walked down and was like, I want out right. of here so bad. He's ready for the next part of the thing. <laughs> He's ready for the next puzzle. Okay, so yeah, like like all you can really see is the the stairs. They're just kind of illuminated from the from the living room, and at the bottom of the stairs is yeah, like I said, like a light hanging from the ceiling with a pull string uh, switch. So uh, yeah, what do you what do you do? Uh, what's uh, Skip? I his damn name. Somebody pull Irving. Skip pulled the switch. Yeah. Irving. Okay, Ir so Irving pulled the switch, um, and the light the light comes on. Um, and the immediate surrounding area is lit, um, but, uh, far off in the distance against the wall, you kind of see the silhouette of a person. Oh, um, is, it, is it the kid? Are they facing uh, it the slowly, car? it slowly walks towards you. Oh, damn. Um, oh, and it comes into the light, hey. and uh. it is the helpful AI assistant, Jeffrey. Ah, Jeffrey. Oh, oh, friend Jeffrey's here. Ah, finally. A breath of fresh air. My name's Jeff. He said, and uh, Jeff Jeff uh, <laughs> walks up to you guys and says, uh, well, it seems, uh, we well, you know, sorry to put you through that, but uh, we had to test, uh, the, we had to test you guys and make sure that uh, you were the, the real deal. And... Uh, you in fact are, and you will, you, I th you guys, I think, are up to the task of helping us. Uh, us. Yeah, yes, uh, me and, uh, uh Master Chucky. Uh, mm -hmm. you see, the thing is, is, uh, I'm part of the reason he's in that coma, you see. You bastard. I, I'm, I, not intentionally, uh. It was, uh, um, I was kind of a pet project he was working on, on the side, um, while, while at Biotechnica. Uh, 
he was trying to create a, a, an AI uh, that could, well, I don't know, be be a person essentially. Um, um, he was he was very close and he couldn't quite crack it. But then one day he realized uh, if he scanned his uh, brain waves and his thought patterns and kind of put put that into the algorithm, it helped bring a little more realism to it. Um, and the kind of really, it was like the last little key for the spark, so to speak. Um, so I owe my life, uh, to, uh, to Master Chucky. Uh, and, um, when, uh, Biotechnica caught wind of this kind of breakthrough of his, they wanted me. Um, and, uh, Master Chucky was having none of that. He knew the corporation's... Would want who knows what the corporations could do with uh, someone of my cap. I don't, you know, not to brag, but someone of my capabilities could do some real damage in the wrong hands. Okay, that is kind um, of bragging. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, well. just, just stay in the facts. All right, well, okay. Um. But yeah, so he hid me away in his uh, servers, and uh, in retaliation, uh, Biotechnica was not a fan of that, and they tried to. They tried to kill him, but uh, uh, it didn't quite work, and it put him in this coma he's in. So uh, wait, Biotechnica is pretty much after you? Yes. Perfect. I'd like to roll uh, Interface to immediately shut down his programming and download him onto a drive. Nice. Okay. okay. Fuck. Oh, well. Never All mind. Right. Um, he, so didn't, he didn't notice that. <laughs> So you, you try to you try to do that in the middle of his big passionate speech to you and he kind of kind of wiggles like blue and kind of stops for a second and then he's like I mean I would have I would have came along with you guys if you just asked that was, you didn't need to you don't need to do that just calm calm down Yep calm down Oh uh, yeah slow your roll skip. there uh, I'm on your side you don't need to yeah you don't need to force to coerce me um Oh, okay. I thought this was like. Sorry, I thought we were about to do some like you're you've turned evil. And no, it, no, 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 and we're no. We're gonna fight you. Oh, no. Okay, listen. I read the situation wrong. I apologize. <laughs> no, no, I, 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 no. I want to. I want to stop Biotechnica from getting hold of my source code and doing nefarious things. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah. I'm so, I read the situation. I apologize. I read this. I read the situation wrong. Yeah, that's yeah. You yeah. way off base. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. Wow. It's not. I wanted to turn evil, but I um. But yeah. So um, the the thing is, is um, I was the one who had sent those messages to uh, Master Chucky's father, uh, that there might be a way, uh, to help him in 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 this in his servers, um. Essentially, my theory is that uh, since he scanned his, essentially scanned his entire brain into my source code, uh, if I were to connect, be connected to him, I could cop, I could paste that di like data, the his brain data back into him, and that might that should kickstart the process of the you know kickstart everything. I would think. Oh, you know. okay. Well, um, then we just need to get out of this program. We need to download you, and we need to try to. I'll link it to his if he's got any uh, neural uh, networks. He should, on him, yes, so. yeah, I believe he does, yes, okay. yeah. So great, okay. So then let's log out. How do we log out of this program? Uh, that's easy. I can do that. Um, and right. uh, Jeffrey brings up a menu and starts swiping, like he's kind of like going through permissions and things like that. Um, and then all of a sudden, as he's doing that, um, kind of from behind you, uh, the wall of the basement, like starts turning into like green outline polygons and stuff and glitches out and kind of disappears. The wall just disappears. And in, and where that, where the wall was is now you see walking towards the group biotechnica, Dave. Oh no, Dave. Oh, not Dave. Um, and he, doesn't doesn't say any words. All he does is he kind of looks down at like a, a, a wrist PDA he has and kind of clicks a couple of things. And then all of a sudden, uh, a blinding white glow kind of engulfs him. 
and then that blinding white light that engulfs him kind of grows um, oh, no. and then fades away. And where that light was is Dave, uh, but he's in like in a big like kind of mech suit kind of thing. Oh, no. Oh, my fuck. Okay. He says, oh my God. And, and he says uh, he says he kind of clicks a little button and then like a little PA system kind of kind of kind of turns on from the from the from the robot and he says uh, uh, I've come to collect what's ours. Um, okay. Oh, the drugs. Yeah. End. Yeah, we got uh, the end, drugs. Of, end of Sorry. end of uh, end of the end of this uh, se- this session. Oh, got okay. it. We're ending right there. All right. Next time, boss battle, Mecha Dave. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> what was the name of our ranger group or whatever from the last Rangers. one? What? Ranger. I have no idea. Something babies, wasn't it? Yeah. I don't. Yeah, I don't remember. Something babies. Power. No, not power babies. Well, we got to figure that out. <laughs> we'll, we'll figure it out next time. Uh, yeah. Next time. Okay. On. All right. Questing crew. Questing crew. Auga. How do you do, questing crew? Um, so yeah, I think that was a. What did you guys think of that session? Yeah, yeah. I liked it. I, I have some it. thoughts. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the puzzles are really well constructed. <laughs> yeah. Have fun. <laughs> shoot, shooting up demons, shooting arrows, uh, doing some tricky troop moves. Yeah. Taking a Please. shit. Take taking taking a little doo doo. <laughs> But no, well, Ryan. See, hard. he purposely wanted they wanted the hacker to go in there and test how good of a hacker they are if he could get into his system. He was testing you. The last time we did one of these, and I tried getting around your puzzles, you made a comment that is like oh. I had these little puzzles. So I was trying to be nice this time <laughs> and not immediately ruin your game. <laughs> I thought I thought the uh, the the made up uh, puzzles were pretty pretty good. Yeah, considering every yeah. single one of them, I made up on the spot. I didn't know. I could tell you were making them up. I was just like, what's the joke here? (laughs) How long is this guy? And I was eventually just like, fuck this. But it was pretty, your solutions are pretty entertaining, Ryan. Those are pretty good. Yeah. That was good. (laughs) Yeah, that was basically just like an improv session. (laughs) Oh, 100%. All right. Thanks for watching. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, thank you for watching. Thank you to the fans. Thanks for questing along. Yeah, thanks for uh, joining the, 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 the crew on our quest. Questing crew, how do you do? Question crew. Thank you, and good night. Good night. I want to say good night. 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 Good night.